Hi everybody, Delta Prime here, and you're watching Delta Prime Reviews. So, I haven't had a video in a little over two weeks. I'm sorry, I've been very busy. I've been also keeping up with the second channel, so that I had a lot to do stuff to. But now, we're going to do a new video review. But before we get into this video review, I want to address a few things. Um, I will more than likely be doing a schedule switch. One week I'll post a video for my reviewing channel, this channel. The other week I'll post a review, a episode of Character Talks on another on my other channel. So that's the plan, Stan. We'll see if it holds. So today we are taking a look at Transformers Legacy United Voyager Class Silverbolt. Now this is a review I've been putting off for a while, and since. Legacy United is hot right now. Let's get right into it. So it's a very faithful, accurate representation of the original Beast Wars Silverbolt. Um, I love it. It's great to have the bird dog. I have Black Arachnia somewhere on my shelf, and it's great to have the bird dog himself to go with her. Because if you don't know, there are a couple in the show. We got his little feather swords that he's iconic for. And he can wield those on in his fists. And they store on the wings via a peg here, peg here. Keep in mind that this one has because of the way it's molded. See, there's a difference in the molding. This one has to go over here. And this one needs to go over here. Okay, so let's get into articulation. Wings are articulated, of course. Head is all ball joint. Or... Yeah, technically a ball joint can look up that much and look down that much. New full 360. There's hinges in here for transformation. Swivel and ball joint. Double arm hinge for transformation. Wrist is on a swivel. Waist does articulate. Swivel, 90 degree bend, ankle tilt, both ways, which is kind of nice. Okay, so, let's get into transformation, because there's something I want to point out. So the first thing you're going to want to do is... Pull these up, and this will go forward so you can take the dog head out of his back. Before we do that, I want to point out a completely useless hinge. Right here. There's no mention of that in the instructions anywhere. I completely figured that out on my own. So it's really weird that they included it. But they did. And I kind of want to know why, and at the same time, I don't want to know. So, yeah, there's that. I guess it makes it easier to lift this dog head out of the way. Anyway, once you're done doing that, peg that piece back in, and then this will go, the robot head will go where the dog head was. You don't want to swivel this around. It's on a swivel. And there's a peg right there. That'll peg right here. Peg that in. And then push down to peg in the dog head. Now, this may look like this is going to hinge out this way, but it's not it's going to hinge this way. And you want to put it like that. So do the same move here. 
peg these together like that. Use that double hinge in the arm. Fold the wolf leg out. Yes, the robot hand sticks out. It's inevitable. They want to make homage to the toy, I guess. Keep the same engineering. That's what they did. All right. There's a peg hole there. They'll peg in there. Like that. Do the same over here. Now you can peg that into place. Take this. Peg that downwards like so. Rotate the arm so that this piece is up here. And there's a peg hole right here. They'll peg into that peg right there. And then, so bend that, angle this, do the same over here. And to finish it off, straighten out the wings. And there, we have Silverbolt in his bird dog mode. Now, it's a really incredible bird dog mode. If if there were real life half eagles, half bird dog, half dogs, this is what I would imagine it looking like. Minus the robot fist in the back, but hey, it's really good. I hate how the tail is shorter than the butt there. It is what it is. The mouth does open. Not much, but it opens. Wings do expand, of course. So, yeah. It's a great, it's a great silver bolt representation. I love it. You know, I fiddle with this toy for hours for days on end. It's really great. It's really awesome. I love it. I'm glad we got a silver bolt. Because my black arachnia finally has her boyfriend. And my silver bolt finally has the dark poison of his heart. So, yeah, I hope you like this short, quick video review. My name's been Delta Prime. I'm asking you to like, comment, and subscribe if you like my video. Or if you find it helpful. Maybe click that little notification bell. And I'll see you in the next video review. Bye-bye.